just go through with us what happened on that Blinken Wang Yi meeting and what that means for the future of U.S. China relations. Well, it, it, it certainly shows that uh, even when the U.S. and China sit down to talk now, which, yes, uh, it, it is or has been a very fraught moment over these past uh, few weeks, uh, that th these talks uh, don't necessarily relieve the tensions uh, that have built up there, certainly not in the short term. And and as you say, the tone uh, from Antony Blinken, who then went on a number of uh, U.S. Uh, TV shows to give interviews uh, shortly afterwards, sort of interpreting what he had told Wang Yi, the tone was was very forceful and and. Um, in its own way, uncompromising. Uh, you talked about uh, Biden saying no apology. Well, uh, what B Blinken said then was, uh, when asked, was uh, that uh, China or Wang Yi did not uh, apologize for the overflight of what the U.S. has called this uh, spy balloon. So, so that kind of gives you an idea of. Uh, of uh, maybe not be neither side backing down, but certainly the level of of uh, rhetoric that we're seeing here.